The game looks cute, but the music is kind of creepy and heery. Oh no. No, forget what I have said. It's tripping and stuff. <laughs> Hello, yeah, guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm just another loser, and you can call me low. And today we'll be playing Pretty Penny Planet. And I don't know a single shit about this game. Well, it's supposed to be some kind of funny god mode game. And that's it. Oh, let's play Find Planet. <laughs> that is a weird planet. Oh, look, a planet. I told you we would find a planet with tiny people on it. Let's micromanage the stardust out of it. Okay, from now on, you're in charge of it. It's a tiresome job though, so you might want to take a century long break after taking a decision. With the right combination of choices, happiness and riches, new events will be available. Writing and etc, discovering fire, do nothing. Well, I would do nothing, but uh, well, discovering fire is pretty important, you know, so let's discover fire. And now we can eat marshmallows. Someone got burned! Ooh! Anyhow, people learn how to make use of fire. They, sh they already knew how to make marshmallows, that's free. My peoples, they're brainy as fuck. A hundred years late. Oh boy, some tree caught fire. They're all dead? The people had to flee in terror. For every action, a consequence. More or less, okay. Learn cooking, make a moon. <laughs> well, it's a bit early to make a moon, right? I'm a, I'm an old school guy, you know, I need to take it easy, step by step. So let's learn how to cook. What oh, the French planet? A cuisinier, I'm a cook now. They learn to make a lot of spaghetti. I'm not the French, uh, it's uh, a pla Italiano planeta. I'm sorry, it was racist, I guess, yeah. Ooh, it seems that you've got a pyromaniac in your planet. The little deviant set some houses on fire. I didn't think about that. <laughs> but there are like 10 people happy or something. I don't know a lot of stuff. Okay, so just, just a little summary. Shut up. Shush, uh, close. Close. Hey, and what's that? It, it allows me to take a, a, cool pic a cool picture of my little planet here. It could be a good screensaver and stuff. A wallpaper, maybe? <gasps> anyway, Pyromaniac, the people had to flee in terror again. So what's the plan for the next century? Smelting, craft, evolution, writing, and etc. I'm an old school kind of guy writing and stuff, but evolution is... It's kind of great. But I have a Pyromaniac. So... I don't, I don't, I don't know what would you do, guys. I mean, I'm a god, but I, I can use some help from time to time, you know? I'm not perfect. I know I am, but... For this video, I'm not perfect. Writing and etc. I guess writing could be cool, because like this we could write on a wall, don't be a pyromaniac motherfucker, and it, people can now preserve knowledge for future generations. This is an Italian chef, but with la plume. The tiny people got good booze and tons of food. When you know how to write and to cook, you, uh, you learn how to drink, apparently. Hey, it's a realistic game, so shut up. May the RNG be in your favor. Oh, fuck. Evolu evolution. We don't need riches. Civilization has gone stale. It's time to spice things up. Yes, it is. A hundred years later. Apparently, these have been very tough times. Scarcity and lack of jobs. Everyone is having a bad time. Let's blame it on bad luck. The RNG, guys. I told you. Science, evolution, dumb labor. What do, what do the tiny people need this time? Farming, grow wings, and fantasy team. Ooh! With wings, you, you, could, you could be free, you know? Like a bird! Farming would solve the job problem, maybe. But a fantasy team, it would be sword art online, so hey. I want, I, want, I want my people to be happy, you know? My Italiano drinking booze people. Farming. I'm not a chef anymore, I'm some redneck, <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing, I'm sorry. Some water, some seed and suddenly crops. A hundred years later. Yeah, brr, who turned on the freeze? Apparently this was a century long ice age. The tiny people stayed indoors in their warm fire heated house, good for them. But what's the little happiness? Oh, see, that's, okay, that's the happiness, wealth and okay, planet, age after planet birth. Okay, <laughs> so there's no happiness. That's the kind of country I'm... kind of world I'm ruling. 
Okay, endless misery. Well, apparently that's already the case, so let's all the festival happiness. Yay! 20 happiness. Is it out of 100 or something? I don't know. People from all over the world are gathering to have a good time. A hundred years later. The tiny people stayed indoors in the warm. Yeah, you already said that. So, grow gills, do nothing, grow wings. Kind of want to grow wings, but hey, I know what gills are. Just want to be sure that it's what I think. And gills are obviously okay. Gills, oh, like the gillywig or something, like like in Harry Potter, you know. Like the fishes and stuff. Uh, wings, oh, wings, wings. People, we want to fly. I have tiny wings, but you can't see them. People want to fly, but they don't like waiting in airplanes. Decision, decision. Let's give them wings. Let's give them wings. Dad, vote for me. If you vote for me, I'll give you wings. A meteorite crashed on your planet. That's not my fault. I'll blame it on the bad luck again. It crushed a town. <laughs> C'est la vie. <laughs> it's kind of just like Widowmaker. She says she says that a lot, but she's French too. So hey, C'est la vie. That's life. Smelting craft. All the festival gruels. What's next? Oh, Captain, my Captain. <laughs> it's full of references and stuff. I like that a lot. Smelting craft. All the festival grow. Let's let's smelt craft. People got good at getting ores, smelting, and using and using tools to get more ores. So now we're like Vikings and stuff. I like that. A Viking farmer drinking booze, well, that's pretty normal, but who knows how to write and hit marshmallows. That's my plan right now. Nothing happened. Perfect. At least your people got to relax. That's what I like. Relaxing is good. One more choice. One more choice. Huh? Our three choices not enough for you. Well, from now on, you get to choose from four. Four choices if you vote for me. I'm not a really a president, I'm a god, so I can rule for hundreds and hundreds of years. The tiny people got the good booze and tons of food. We already, we already had that. We're all drunk and stuff now, but at, at least we're happy. Let's party! That's how we party here. Keeping your people happy will eventually make them wealthy. Plan accordingly. I think it's time to go... Capitalist. Let's add riches! You fill the world with riches and the people started hoarding them. <laughs> I did great. More money, more flair. What's that big hole they're digging in? Seems to be a mine. That's right, I'm a Viking dwarf now. Now, now a little. But I already have the cool beard, so hey. Well, my planet does. Mine is pretty regular. But my planet, look, look, look. That, my planet had abs in its freaking beard, so hey. Medieval weapon reaches on the festival grow gills. Well, if I add weapon, they'll start to kill each other. So hey guys, leave them the water. I wonder if these people would enjoy breathing underwater. Let's find out. We would all of that. Swimming the fishes and stuff. Rawr, swimming away from the sharks. Would love, would love that. I would love that. Turns out your people don't know how to mine well and they cause the mine to collapse. Thankfully, they had wings that helped them leave the place. Hooray for the wings! No big deal. I know, I know. I gave them wings. I gave them gills and stuff. Praise the Lord, Lou! Keeping your people happy with... Shut up. All the festival and it had riches again. For science! For science, bitch! Sure, give them knowledge. Just remember that sometimes science is more art than science. I'll keep that in mind. But if I give them science, I'll be able to give them, to, to give them like, enhanced weapons, right? Turns out your people don't know. Yeah, but I, they had, they had wings, again! Wings for everyone, you want wings? Wings for you, wings for me! <sighs> come on, come on, come on, computers, they need computers. <gasps> Coloborama, fuck yeah! It's time to introduce the world to the wonders of glorious PC Master Race! <laughs> Fuck yeah! Okay, Vikings playing computers after farming a bit because you know they need food and stuff. They know science, but the booze is gone! And so are the marshmallows. But I have a computer, I don't care. Nothing happened in a hundred years. Let's try again, of course. Well, when you're a freaking Viking spending your time on computer and farming and stuff, you need to up. My beard is gone! But the meteorite is like straight on my face. I <laughs> it was hidden under my beard at first. So I oh so here are my gills. 
My wings are gone too. I have like braces. You people need braces. They were expensive, but they are far healthier now. Happiness. Perfect. Keep your braces. I, I heard some people loved it as well, like weird fetishes and stuff, but braces for you. He seems that you've got a pyromaniac again. Frank! We told you to stop burning houses and not pyromaniac in the house. <laughs> English, motherfucker. I do speak English from time to time. Thankfully, everyone retreated to the ocean. Water breathing is such a blessing. Fuck yeah, again. Wings. Gills, what do you want, guys? A huge tail, speeding fire. I can do that. I'm good. Rest, competitive gaming. Of course, competitive gaming, guys. We we have computers and stuff. The tiny people decided to get good at video games, and they held a century-long tournament. It was a good time. Oh, Doritos and oh, Mountain Dew for everyone. It's even better than Wings, right? I don't know. <laughs> and plot twist, I never had the opportunity to try Mountain Dew. I'm sorry guys, I'm not a true gamer, I know. What's that big O there digging in? Seems to be a mine, it will collapse, but they've got wings, we're fine, fine, fine. Yep, they struck gold, this will look so good in their GDP. Yeah, you're kinda of repeating yourself here. Medieval weapon, all the face to, oh, I don't wanna, I'm gonna go competitive gaming again, but let's make a moon. Oh, look at it, that's so beautiful. Patricia, Patricia the moon. No, Manuela, because it's, Pretty funny planet, and I love I love alliteration. So you are Manuela now. Shut up, Patricia. You're Manuela now. It seems that you've got a pyro. Shut up. We have, we have gills. It's okay. I'll buy you a new house. Fucking humans. Get out. Uh, why am I talking like Mickey Mouse? Mysterious defects. Competitive gaming. Rest. I think it's time for some old, some good old fantasy team. Nothing has changed at all. Nothing is fantasy. Oh, nothing is fantasy about my look. Okay, oh, 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 see, oh, we, oui. the hell's uh, kind of ears. Yeah, let's feel worse with mystical racist creature and dragon. Everyone loves dragons. We do love dragons, don't you, Kalisi? <laughs> of course, she loves dragon. It appears that some group of misfits, including some elf, a dwarf, and even a tenier people, are embarking on a quest. That's Harry Potter all over again, guys! <laughs> it's not Harry Potter, it's Narnia, I know! Some jewelry delivery thing, here's hoping they do alright, let's ask around some other time. Well, I kinda wanna help them. Magic, rest, all the festival, come. Magic, magic, time for... I'm a... I'm a pimp, it's not even a mage hat, it was a pimp hat. How about adding some wizards and spellcasters to the planet? Not a bad idea, huh? Well, if those... Guys are on a quest, they might need a powerful wizard. Just saying. A hundred years later. How's the quest? Oh boy, some trees caught fire. Gills, wings, whatever you want. Thankfully, everyone retreated to the ocean. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Don't 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 bother me with some an Colosorama. Oh So I guess it's like a Rider Rumble Gold Transmutation. Oh I don't know Eric, it's for you. The wizard are transforming random stuff into gold, I guess that's a good thing. I guess not, but it sounded cool. And Colosorama seems really brutal, I don't want my people to kill each other. It's a pacific world, okay? With a pyromaniac, but hey, it's Frank and his kind. I ask around about an epic jewelry they request, the people are long dead, but they are still being talked about. But I had wizards. They got into trouble, got separated, something, something, non fly non flying winged monster. But I gave them wings. I killed them. I don't know. <laughs> your choices might change the result of the event that happened while you're away. Experiment. Well, you know what? Sometimes it's good to take a uh, hundred years of resting. Happiness. You let the tiny people mind their own business for a century. I'm sure they did great. So happiness is not a percentage. It's like. A random number. A hundred of years and a hundred years of nothing. Perfect. Why do we even bother? That's what I'm asking people. You're doing great. You have Mountain Dew, computers, braces, I guess. You can fly, you can swim. You even have a cool pimp mage hat. Ooh, oh, manga online streaming, manga online streaming. I, I, I have to go with online streaming because we already have elf and stuff for so, so it's already fantasy enough 
and online streaming. I mean, I wouldn't even be there without online streaming. So yay, apparently the tiny people of watching us are people who do funny stuff on the web. Everyone is doing it now. Breaking the fourth wall game. Cause that's what we are doing right now. It'd be cool if you could stream the development of planet, don't you think? Wink wink. Breaking the fourth wall again. <gasps> the game is speaking to me. I have a cool, a cool ass headset now, but it's going under my mouth. Pretty weird. It's gotta hurt. I don't know. Let's stream about the development of planets. People from all over the world gathered. It wasn't hard, it's a very small planet to watch a magical showdown. Good for you people creating events and stuff. I'm proud of you guys. The scientists showed up as well. It gave them a lot of material to research. I like their optimism. Well, everything is going to be fine. Rest, competitive gaming, at Rich's dental plan. Competitive gaming again. I like my people to be happy. The tiny people decide to get good. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm starting to be bored. I've got the whole world is doing great. Advanced science. I guess it's time, guys. The tiny. Oh, the little chipset on my head. Building robots and machines and whatnot. Has science gone too far? Let's push it to the limit. Another screenshot because I my planet looks cute. <laughs> I'll probably edit the headset though because I want it to be uh, above my mouth because I love realism. Zim, zim, zim. Turns out your people don't know how to. Yeah, wings, 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 of course. <laughs> Colossorama, rest, space travel. Space, oh, the little. Oh, I have my own little ship now. Smooth. Took me so long to say that word, I don't even know why. <laughs> hey, now they're leaving the planet. There's nothing wrong with a little independence. Perfect with me. As long as you're keeping it cool and stuff, don't kill each other, guy. Peace planet. If they really want to live somewhere else, they're going to need to fund their colonization program. I have the money, I have the power, I have everything you need. Trust me. Just praise me and stuff. Oh, manga, it's time to add some cool ass mangas. Amazing! The computer is gone, but Vegeta has a, already a one Dragon Ball. The fourth one, apparently. What does the scooter say about my planet level? I don't know, yeah, you know, you know. But the scarf is blue now. And my braces are gone and my headset is perfectly here now. Better the feketeta. We'll turn on the fridge, the tiny people stay in. Good for them, yes, stay inside, be happy. Lycanthropy. Or monarchy. Lycanthropy. Oh, perfect, I have my little furry ears now, I'm so hot. Braces are gone, furries are in. It's like the evolution, you know? <laughs> Fetishist and stuff. Let's give people fang and fur every now and then. I like that a lot. Mr. Lupin, what do you think about that? Colossorama, medieval weapons, monarchy. Well, okay, fight if you want to fight people. The tiny people wanted entertainment. Let's give them an arena, a colosseum of Mayhem, a colossorama. My furry ears are gone and I have, I have a cool ass helmet. Oh, but it fits perfectly with my... Oh, so smooth, I'm all blue and stuff. Screenshot. Favorite planet. Best planet it is. A robot warrior who read mangas while hitting Doritos and drinking Mountain Dew with a cool scarf and a freaking tiny little Manuela Moon. I didn't forget you, Manuela. <laughs> and my own spaceship. Hey. We're doing great. Of course we are. A hundred years of nothing. A hundred years of happiness. What do we even bother? Game Devception? Oh, the first Game Devception, I mean, hey. VR! The game got so good on the planet that everyone suddenly entered the game development hype. FNAF, Minecraft and stuff, that's because of them. But that's perfect! More freedom, more people, more indie games! Every week, a new game jam for ages. It was glorious. Fuck yeah! The tiny game devs no longer have a reason to leave their home, so let them do their best while we go inspire another planet. But that's... But that's my plan! Everyone can be a game dev, even you! Game jam ending. Okay, <laughs> that's great! Okay, so that's my ending. I look cool! My planet is like... 2,700 years, still a bit young, but I did great, right? I mean, 145 wealth and 180 happiness, it's out of, I don't know, out of something, it's still great, and my planet looks perfect. I like that a lot, still 
medieval warrior in a VR. Well, maybe it's a medieval game. That's why I had the medieval helmet, you know, because I'm inside the game. It feels real. I'm still holding my Dragon Ball Z manga because yeah, I'm addicted and stuff. And I have my Mountain Dew and my, my, my Doritos not far away from me. And my my blue scarf, my favorite blue scarf. That's why I'm no I'm no I, I'm known for on YouTube, you know, my blue scarf. It's, it's like, oh, just another loser, the blue scarf. I, it's, oh, it's obvious. Okay, I want to find a new planet, at least not right now. I probably will do it on my own because I like this kind of game, you know, it's, it's, it's cool to see your planet evolving and stuff. But you guys can do it on your own. I'm gonna leave a link in the description below and stuff, and I'm sure you're gonna have fun. Tell me what kind of planet you you, you actually created. Send me screenshots as well, if you can, on Twitter and stuff. It could be fun to, to compare our planets and stuff. Back in the day, I used to compare the size of my... No, I didn't do that in the shower. Never. I was the longest and the biggest. But guys, that was gross and weird, but that's it for today. We're gonna stop this episode here, and if you enjoyed it, crush the like button. If you don't want to miss anything, subscribe and join Lose Evil. I'll see you on the next episode and maybe on the a, on a next planet. Probably not, but hey, enjoy. Stay tuned and rock on. <laughs>